Good day. Are you able to find the missing number in this rather hard puzzle for all ages? The numbers in the puzzles are as follows. In the first row, we have 1, 2, 3. Second row, 4, 5, 6. Third row, 7, 8, 9. In the third row, in the fourth row, sorry, it is 11, 12, 13. And in the final row, we have 18, 30 and a question mark. So what is the number that is represented by the question mark? If you want to have a go at this puzzle, press the pause button now. But if you want to know the solution, keep watching. Welcome back to the solution of this rather hard puzzle for all ages. The numbers are straightforward. First row, 1, 2, 3. Second row, 4, 5, 6. Third row, 7, 8, 9. Third row, 11. Sorry, the fourth row is 11, 12, 13. And in the final row, we have 18, 30 and the question mark. So what is the number represented by the question mark? So without further ado, let's try to solve this problem. So if you look at the row, 1, 2, 3, it doesn't make sense. Uh, 4, 5, 6, it could be done, but it's quite difficult in the sense that it's all increasing by 1. So I suggest that we go to the column. So we need to manipulate 1, 2, 4, 7, 11 to give us 18. 2, 5, 8, 12 to give us 30. And 3, 6, 9, 13 to give us the question mark. So this is the solution. And what we're going to do, we first going to multiply the middle number. Okay, We're going to multiply 4 by 7. So that will give us 28. Okay. Okay. So now to get 18, we take 11 minus 1. Remember, the two middle number we're going to multiply. 4 times 7 is 28. Then we're going to minus the fourth row with the first row. So 11 minus 1 will give us 10. And then the last step, we're going to minus them. 28 minus 10 is going to give us 18. Similarly, we're going to take the middle number and multiply them. 5 times 8 is going to be 40. I'm going to write here 40. And then you take 12 minus 2 will also be 10. So 40 minus 10, that will give us 30. So in our final column, we have 3, 6, 9, 13. So you multiply 6 times 9 is going to be 54. And then we're going to take 13 minus 3, which is 10. We're going to minus them 54 minus 10 and the question mark is going to be 44. I believe most of you will get it right because you guys are geniuses and I'll see you in the next one. Cheers.